And hello folks, it is I Kamikaze here to uh, bring you another random review of another random product. Uh, I have always loved Nerf guns, dart guns, any kind of like blaster gun. One I've never been able to be like, I want to output the money for it because I have no purpose for it. My cats hate them, absolutely. And I've never shot them. They just absolutely hate the sound of the ch -ch -ch. Um, But in this case, there is one type I was trying to get forever ago. And um, then I also found a full-on metal style with, with all the bells and whistles. But then, um, in short, it was a type of gun, and I just couldn't find it. And found out that it, it wasn't discontinued. It just was kind of a little hard to find. And people were selling for like $50 on eBay. And I got one. Not for $50. I got this for... Wait, there we go. 15 from the Dollar General. So, I don't know why, and I've also found that they're in stock on, like, uh, currently, on, uh, Walmart's webpage and whatnot, so. But the reason for this one, unlike other ones, it's like, Nerf guns, you always, like, put the darts back in, and then you fire, to to fire, to to fire, and it just, it just didn't, I didn't feel like I was a part of the gun, a part of the battle, a part of anything. So, um, I've always wanted a shotgun with the ability to, uh, have shells, which there are ones. There's two different types of this. There's ones that's like a double barrel that you can put darts in shells and it will eject the shells. It's pretty cool. But I decided not to go with that one because, um, well, I shouldn't have spent money on this to begin with. Uh, if I could get this open, that'd be great. There we go. Um, this one, on the other hand, can hold... Far more. If I could. Oh, wait, here? Here, maybe? No, apparently these scissors did not want to cut this. Come on, there we go. Alright, and only one more left. Instead of those twisty ties, these things have zip ties, it seems like. So, but now that that's done. Oh, there was one more. Great. Dang it. I really don't want anyone opening these. Ah, yes. Now you see why I don't have my green screen on. Because obviously this would disappear. But lo and behold, we're actually going to show you that anyway. Uh, filters. Like filters. Doink. That should be pretty badass in Vanta Black. But unfortunately, that's not a color that's an option. So, what this is, is unlike other, uh, like shotgun nerf things or whatnot that you just, like, load a dart in and fire, this one has some. Apparently, an adjustable sight. But it has a rail system, which I don't know how to open it yet because I've never read the instructions. Uh, let's get the darts because darts are important. I think that's it. All right. So does it explain? Oh, that's how that. <laughs> cool. All right. So let's. Uh, open the darts that are sealed like six times because that's vitally necessary to mankind. Uh, and so opens up its anus and you put one in. You just keep feeding them in. Oh, you just keep feeding them in. Okay, so it's got a, a clear chamber up here, which I thought you'd see like the darts or whatnot, but you see them underneath. I don't think they're actually. How many can fit in this? Oh, I'm still feeding. Oh, I think that's it. I think the, the most you can stick in is seven.
Oh, let's see here. Oh, that is actually pretty, pretty nifty. So, uh, the clear thing is just to look cool, I guess. Cosmo. It's weird. Uh, it doesn't matter. I can point my finger at Cosmo and she'll meow at me. I mean, you can't see this. But she has absolutely no fear of this or its sound. This is much quieter than I expected it to be because, like, other guns are like, Jerka! Well, let's see how well this fires. Oh, wow. That actually fires a lot better than I thought it would. So, how does this... Yes, I'm looking down the barrel of a, of a toy shotgun because I want to know how it functions. Pulls it all the way back, and a dart falls right onto place. Then this pushes forward. So then the mecha uh, mechanism here, it doesn't actually, like, have it back here. It's just all happening right up here. And I think, uh, when we look at this box, 12 long-distance starts with detachable sight. Detachable? Is this detachable? Oh. Answered. I wonder if you could put some real, like, things, like, put a laser sight or, like, you know, sniper scope on it. Uh, it's, it's cool. It's actually pretty well, but not that it was broken. This is actually a, is this an access? I think it is. Oh, and there's the spring. Or that's, no, that's not the spring I thought it was. Um, a lot of dart guns you can end up modifying by increasing the tension and make the darts fly farther past their recommended capabilities. But it's got like an anti-jam thing, so if there's a, a problem, you can like try and figure it out there. That's actually pretty nifty. So it's not like cheaply designed and whatnot, and so this is not made by Nerf. This is made by Busby Toys. But, um, yeah, let, let me just... That, that's actually pretty cool. And then I could just like reload the darts into the butt of it. I'm ready to go in with my Bucky. Valorant players will know what I mean. Then again, I mean, this would be like the right click point blank with a Bucky. One damage or five damage. Or was it 20? I don't remember. But uh, yeah, I just wanted to show off my new stupid toy, which will have absolutely no purpose. It's just the fact that I've wanted one for years. This thing came out in 2017. And uh, I never wanted to spend 50 bucks on it. And so I managed to get my hands on one cheaper. Some people are still selling them used for 50 bucks online. As well as the other ones. Well, that was just my worthless little toy review here. Now, be that be valley quiet. I'm going to hunt hippies. No, not really. I will not shoot my cats with an arc gun. Toodles.